Hi guys, uh, it's camping time. Usually around this time when school is about to open, we'll do like a mini camping trip uh, just to let the, the kids say bye to a good nice vacation time. Since summer is ending, uh, well let me say since school uh, break is ending, next week is back to school. We decided to do camping right here in our backyard, but it was just too humid. This was on a Monday. It was just too humid, guys. So we decided to just do the camping inside the house and it worked out fine. So we'll let uh, my daughter enjoy her camping till this Friday. And then next week we'll be back to school. So... Uh, you see, uh, I'll sh also show you uh, a little uh, shopping we did for our school, back to school shopping yesterday. And then you'll see the back to school shopping that we did today. So come along. <music> Keep on going, Nancy. Don't even think about it. We are not here for you. We are not shopping for shoes. I know they are cute and all. You'd like each pair for each dress here. But hey, just keep on going. Keep 
Pongo and you don't even see these shoes. You don't even see these beautiful shoes. Just keep on going. When we drop it off, first Brooks went in, then everyone ran to Brooks and then they, they one of them, uh, they hugged them, and then Bernardo said they ran again, and then all of them hugged him, and then he said, Mommy said, um, he beat me to us, but he doesn't mean me to strangers. <laughs> and we're his family. See, I'm going to talk nice. Say no. So, uh, so we, we dropped my son at his workplace today because he doesn't have his car. Uh, so, <laughs> so he works at a, uh, what is it? A camping, a, a camp school, right? A karate camp. Yeah, a karate camp. So, <laughs> we, so we were waiting for him to get in. And then the friend, apparently his friend uh, was ahead of us, was getting in. So we saw the, all these kids running to, uh, to the friend. So when he got in the class, uh, the kids swam to him and like running to him, like calling his name, like whatever. So me, I was like, my daughter was like, so you, Padashan, you you will be mean to us, but yet you are nice to other people. Strangers, you're, you're nice to strangers. Ah, I loved. I was like, but I don't know what it's like. Like, yeah, it so happens that you know you are so um, welcoming and nice to strangers, but your own family you tend to be. I don't know. It's not mean, but I think you expect more. Like for me, for example, when I used to work at a, a daycare and in a, in a school district you cannot be mean to other kids like i couldn't find myself being mean to other kids uh, because i'm like ah that's the parents job uh not mean as such but like more stricter or you know you know of course you tell them if something is wrong you know i'm not talking like that but you know you're just more open but with your family i found that with my own family i'm more strict because i'm expecting more i don't know what it is but i just found it so funny that my uh i saw my son in this picture uh that wow kids these kids this is uh a, a camping place from kids from age like i think it's from five to to 12 years old i think yeah so it, it was just funny it was just funny anyway guys how are you doing today welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel welcome my name is nancy and today we are taking you along to this uh back to school shopping wow i cannot school is next wednesday yeah I are you excited yes and i'm eight years old I know. Are you excited to see your new teacher? Mm -hmm. Me too. Uh, so next week we do the we meet the teacher. We go to see the class on Monday. So I'm excited. But this summer, man, this summer went by so fast. I was so busy, so so busy. I don't know where the summer went. Like wow, it's already done. I think it, I was so busy because I was busy. Uh, sometimes I would drop my son. We were doing the college hunting. We were, oh, I was just, I feel like I was just going back and forth. Like I, I didn't do anything that I wanted to do. But anyway, it's all good. So yeah, summer is done. Next week I'll be now concentrating on my son to shopping his back to school stuff. But yeah. So come along, we'll show you, you know. Yeah, so, yeah, so, you know, guys, for, for uh, schools yeah. over here, they yeah. don't wear yeah. uniforms. Well, most public schools, let me say it like that, don't wear uniforms here in the yes. United States. 
which i'm sad about it i wish they did but some public schools depending on where you live they do wear uniforms i hate uniforms but you know it's cheaper when you have uniforms because you own you own your only worry as a parent will be just buy uniforms school uniforms and school shoes you know uh rather than having uh but clothes. girl i have to wear a dress and i don't like dress yeah, I know. Or you have to wear a skirt, and I don't like skirts. I know, but they have uh, shorts too for girls if you would like to wear uh, shorts. Yeah, yeah she so I don't doesn't like, like dresses, she doesn't like skirts, so it's a challenge. But anyway, yeah, so it, it gets to be expensive uh, during back to school. It's like August disease in the middle of the year. It leaves At you broke I... because they, they you have to buy school clothes because they would have grown this or you know three months summer is it two months yeah two months just on on a school break eating and sleeping they would have grown so you have to buy new shoes and new clothes two things years, like that school's done and again. you have to buy school supplies lucky for us i just buy before they the clothes for school so i buy my school supplies children. through the school that way i don't have to run around looking for school supplies so it's busy it's busy but you know what i'm glad uh the summer is almost oh, done because it's it's, it's, it, it's been so busy and it's been so hot really hot yeah so come along we'll take you along to do this school shopping and we'll see how it goes and the fun begins <laughs> This girl is difficult to shop for, guys. She doesn't like any girly, girly stuff. No pink, no dresses, no skirts whatsoever. She doesn't like tight jeans. If it's too tight, she won't like it. And, yeah, she, she, it has to be more like a Tommy, Tommy kind of girl. That's what she likes. But I was telling her, you know, we need more designers who make this kind of uh bigger kind of stuff i don't know she just doesn't like girly girly stuff <laughs> so uh, let's see how this goes she says anything that is too tight is itchy <laughs> because she just doesn't want to wear anything too tight so she says it's itchy <sighs> it's gonna be a long day <laughs>